Hello everyone, it's Wednesday and that means it's time for another food review. Today I'm going to be sampling these peanut butter toast crackers from Savor, it's for kids. Oh, I can't wait. As with previous food reviews, I'm going to be looking at the appearance, quality, and price of these crackers so that way I can determine a total possible point value of 15 out of 15. Let's go find out a little bit more about these peanut butter toast crackers. I found this little package of cracker sandwiches at Aldi for a low, low price of 89 cents. Not 99, 89 cents. I do love how the packaging is very transparent and minimalistic. I personally do not believe that this needs to be in a box. I would have liked a box, but for the way they've presented this product, I think this works out well. And plus, there are some very cute drawings on this packaging. I mean, look at that happy kite. I want to be as happy as that kite. Now that we got that out of the way, let's move on to the taste test. And this is probably the part where I struggle. We shall see. Oh, sh okay, okay. Ooh. Okay, so that was a little deceiving, but these little crackers come in a package of four, but it says right on the packaging, six packs of four. I I'm stupid sometimes, okay? I, I don't read things thoroughly, I guess. But uh, they look like this, and we're going to open this, and we're going to take one cracker, and, well, determine if it tastes good or not. I'm expecting a lot of peanut butter in this bite. Pretty damn good. I'm, I'm gonna finish this off. I will say this much already in regards to that taste test. There is plenty of peanut butter within the cracker, or so it seems when you look at it, but when you taste it, you, you get that peanut butter sensation for a good couple seconds, and then there's no aftertaste, which some people may like. But if you're a peanut butter fan like me, you kind of want a little bit of that sensation after the fact. So let's move on to the final thoughts. As for the appearance of these crackers, I'm definitely going to give it a 5 out of 5 because everything's there. The nutrition facts, the way the product looks, uh, I mean, what you're getting out of it, there's nothing to imagine from the appearance of this product, both in regards to the packaging and to the cracker itself. In regards to the quality, this was a very tough decision for me to make, but unfortunately I'm going to have to give it a 3 out of 5 only because, and this is coming from an adult's perspective, okay, let me get that out of the way first. If you were to give this snack to a child, they would love it. They'd be completely fine with it. They don't, they're not hard to please. And if your children are hard to please, then you need to go discipline them. But anyway, getting back onto the point, I give these crackers a three out of five in quality because when I snack, I prefer to have my snacks fill me up for a good hour, maybe at least, before I get that hunger sensation, that feeling again. And unfortunately, these crackers only made me want to eat more crackers because the peanut buttery taste was not strong. It wasn't very strong. It was kind of mild at, at best. I felt like it was more flaky in texture than it was in smooth that I expect from the peanut butter inside the cracker. And finally, for price, I'm going to have to give this a solid 4 out of 5 only because uh, based on the appearance and the quality beforehand, I would expect a product like this to be sold at a maximum of 75 cents and not 90 cents. Overall, these crackers get a total of 12 out of 15 and that's pretty dang good. So congratulations, Savor It's for kids. You're, you don't have a terrible product. I would buy this again. And if you're in Aldi, if you want a snack for yourself or for your children, I say go for it. And that's going to be it for this food review. As always, if you have any suggestions, any other products, foods you want me to review, please let me know in the comments below. Be sure to give this a like and I guess subscribe. I don't like saying that, but I'll just say it anyway. But until next time, I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.